Yeah, I did want to check real quick. Ooh. Curious. This guy sure likes rabbits. Ooh. Okay. Hello everybody, and welcome back once again to Emma Void's Let's Play of Battle Chef Brigade. Last we left off, we had won our first match, and I fooled around in the test kitchen for a little bit, and now I'm going to uh, rush through some Quick, money making. Quick, there's so much to do. Swiss, stop biting my toes. Stop biting my toes. Yeah, I remember having cats and them doing that. Belchior, I was wondering something. I couldn't stop thinking about it over breakfast. What's that? This seems like an awful lot of work for just one batch of formula, even if it's the ultimate. Will you have to make all these recipes and extract their essences every time? Ha! Ah, that's a good question, my astute assistant. <laughs> if I'm successful, the brigade will assist me in reproducing ambrosia more efficiently. Then chefs from all around can have a bottle to spray my flavor magnifier on anything. I can dig it. Interesting. This won't be a shortcut to proper cooking, though, will it? Never. Like any seasoning, it can be used properly, but it can also be used poorly. But enough chat. Let's get to work! Cool. You've used a specialist pot before, right? These beauties are attuned to a particular elemental taste gem. You only need ma you need only match two gems from that color to promote. However, other taste gems will not promote. Give it a try. Oh, all right. So um, let's pick this up and plop it down here. And. Take this and pick it up and put it down over here. Nice. Did your parents' restaurant use many bony ingredients? Not often. There aren't a lot of big monsters around our village. In that case, take care with this dish. Line up three bones and they'll turn into a delicious rainbow gem. Ah, see, I figured that out while I was messing around in the uh, test kitchen. So... Oops. Might help if I actually didn't... Wait, I can do this, I swear. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Alright, so let's try this one out then. Start it over again. Yeah. Okay, try that again. Tag me there. Yeah. 
50. I mean, I'd be willing. What do we got? Oh. Gouda, what are you doing in there, silly? What? You have a coin, too? I'm starting to think these cats are richer than I am. <laughs> uh. I'm closed for business today, so get lost. Oh! I'm sorry. Hold it! I'm just kidding. I should really pack up and go somewhere, though. Maybe the caverns, deep in the mountains, where I can be warm, yet never have to see the outside world again. Oh, Thorin. Jeez, what's with all the doom and gloom? And I thought I was hard on myself. <laughs> what would a youngster like you know? Ooh. I heard some tourists talking about you yesterday, completely agog over some backstab move. Let's see if it's worth the praise. Oh, backstab the scowl to get close for an attack. Alright, so... Interesting. Be careful of that. Hmm. Whoa, what? What? Oh, God. <laughs> You're tiny and adorable. pick up flavors. That's cool. Girl, you wouldn't happen to be versed in remedy foods, would you? Uh-uh. I'm sorry, instructor. That sounds like something Kieran would know. She's usually around Belkior's workshop. A cat geezer, hmm? I'm looking for headache relief, not a headache giver. <laughs> Recruit. Most of my guests don't have a lot of time to chat, but the few that do tell grand stories. In addition to your wages, I'm happy to share my favorite of the day with you, if you do a good job. Yes, ma'am. I'll do my best. Sounds good to me. Just remember that if you take too long to serve customers, they'll leave. 
Let's not keep them waiting. All right, so I need um, wait, no, I mean, there we go. Oh, um, this looks wonderful. There we go. Oof, Very much goodness. appreciated. Okay, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, crud. Okay. Oh, this is perfect. No, wait, I need... Oh, that's hard. Okay, um... That, and I need... No, wait. There we go. Spreading strange rumors of a Karana with an evil aura. Ooh. Claimed it snuck into her house and tried to eat her dog. <laughs> Yikes. I've never heard of a Karana doing that before. Interesting. Welcome to our store. Make your Hey hey, home. enjoying the tournament? Knock any of the competition out already? That's not pride, dear brother. Nonsense. I'm sure she's excited to talk about her bouts. Aren't you? I would be. Maybe she just wants to browse without having her head talked off. I'm just gonna let them sort this one out. Mm, ooh, okay. Stun dive. Stuns enemies when bouncing on them. Ooh, that sounds good. Stunning dagger. First one's tricky, second one's easy. Dash strike. Hit and run. Dodging past enemies does damage. Oh, those are cool. Hmm. Ah, oh, they're expensive, though. Okay. So I can get one of them. I'm gonna maybe say... Stun Dive. And... Plus times two... Hmm. Okay. So now the question is, who are we going to play against? Um, hey, why is her jacket still over there? She's wearing it. That's weird. Mm. Okay. Let's see if we can get this guy to talk. No. I haven't even said anything. Oh. Have a nice day, I guess. Alright, screw you too. Hey, Kirin, would you mind having a match? Certainly. I'm sure you could learn a few things, and I could use an easy win. Uh, hey! <laughs> really, Mina, you can't let your opponents fluster you so easily. Come along. Alright, so... Hmm... Okay. Let us begin.
I woke this morning reminded of a quote from the legendary chef Robichon. An ingredient is only as extraordinary as the chef who wields it. <laughs> when I look at our contestants, I see the precision of their blades and the richness of 10,000 flavors boiling in their hearts. Extraordinary doesn't even begin to cut it. I cannot wait to see the wonder they have in store for our judge today. Riding on the winds of her first victory, the Iron Stomach is ready to claim another win. Mina! Kieran has studied medicinal gastronomy since childhood. Her unwavering attention to detail earned her the title, The Decisive Blade, Ooh. from her instructors. An interesting matchup indeed. <laughs> Kieran! That judge is headmistress of the prestigious Aurus Academia. Please welcome Instructor Meridane! Ooh. You've no need to flatter me so. We'll soon discover just how competent these chefs truly are. Water is mercurial yes. by nature. A chef that truly masters its flavor becomes as adaptive as the energy itself. It is in your best interest to impress me with it. For today's theme ingredient, we look to a beast that has a heart of fire. Mm. Every hunter knows the fearsome Dragon! Oh, good. I'm glad I picked that stun power because I'm hoping that'll help out a little. Vive la Brigade! Dragon battle. Maybe go grab another bone ingredient real quick. <laughs> there we go. Gotcha. Alright, that should be enough.
That's not what I meant to do, but oh well. Let's see what our judge has to say about your efforts. A delicacy. Nochi fruit macarons topped with cheek chi breast and squickle stomach medley. Did you listen to what I said at the beginning of the match? This dish needed to exude watery flavor. To achieve that, water must have the most super superlative gems in the dish. A lovely example of culinary prowess. Oof. Lovely. Dragon heart dumplings topped with dragon shank and baron ribs melange. You've captured the essence of watery flavors without your dish becoming overly complex. A near perfect interpretation. My only complaint is that it is a bit oversalted. The iron stomach clenches another hard fought victory. <laughs> Lena Hart wins! Woohoo! <laughs> that was pretty good. You certainly are more resourceful than you appear. I underestimated you. Gee, thanks. <laughs> I meant only to say that you show a lot of promise for your age. Here, take this. May it aid you in your battles ahead. Ooh, Kirin's winged boots. Double jump, nice. Alright, well, that went pretty well, I'd say. <laughs> let's check that out. So those are, yeah, it's gonna be another combat item. Man, it's gonna be hard to be able to decide which combat items to use. Alright, well, I'd say that's probably about it. Yeah, for today. This. Anyways. I should really study more recipes right now, but <laughs> I'll just take a quick nap. Uh-huh. <laughs> right. Hey, what you reading? Oh, I'm just perusing the new expertise tome I bought from Louie and Louie. Louie and Louie, I got it. Yes, it's the study of a particular esoteric cooking style or technique. You should really take a look into some. Judges award bonuses for demonstrating the use of expertises. Hmm. Here, you can have one of mine. I've got the contents of that tome committed to memory. Interesting. Apprentice expertise, butcher, waste not, want not. Serve a dish containing all ingredient types from your match's theme ingredient. Mm. Really? Wow, thanks, Kieran. You're welcome. If you don't mind, though, I have to get back to studying. Well, let's take a look at that. Oh, it's a cooking item. Cool. Ooh. Curious. This one's about the brigade. The three branches of the brigade are research, military, and ambassador. 
Hmm, interesting. Oh. Good morning, lad. Off to another day of battle. Yeah, sure. Interesting. Huh, I never noticed this bowl before. Does the innkeeper have a pet? Is this guy gonna talk to us yet? Hello, sir. <sighs> Tell me, girl. What about an old dwarf smoking his pipe in a stairwell makes you want to bother him? Sorry for the interruption. See you around. <sighs> Wait. Granite of garnets. Sorry? It's a dwarven saying. It's between good luck and see ya, but not so frivolous. Ah, well, thank you very much. Mm hmm. <laughs> We've got all the kitchenware you need. <laughs> Anything new today? You bet, only the finest. Well, technically, brother, we've got an even better assortment of things to put up for sale tomorrow. Today, tomorrow, no thing to fuss. We always have good things to sell, so be sure to check every day, okay? Okay, I will. Thanks. Ooh. How's it going? Sounds like Powell's just as cooked by Thorn as you are. What? How could you hear him? I've heard him whispering at night sometimes, mostly about being hungry for monster flesh. Whoa, your sword really talks? Uh, not exactly. He speaks to me using our spiritual link from my right of elements. No one else should be able to hear him. <laughs> what should be and what is are generally two different things, Thrashy. In fact, I think I hear Paul right now. He says, 404, text not found. <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm not from around here, but I can barely understand half the stuff Siggy says. <laughs> can you not? What's new, Shiv? Nothing, really. How many wins do you have so far? That's none of your business. Oh. <laughs> That's not great. Well Oops. Alright, so let's do a few more um, jobs. I've got a here we slew go. of real noggin twisters here. I'm so glad you showed up. Oh yeah. What's the issue? Oh, getting the essences out of dishes is getting more complicated the further down my list I go. Well, let's try our best. I don't suppose you used fancy sauces much before, have you? I have in fact. Well, no. My family's menu has a very straightforward style. Not to worry. Sauce in a dish just changes the flavor of the topmost taste gems it lands on. Sauce is, a is perfect when you've got too many of the wrong taste gems. Whoa, that sounds really useful. Alright. Pantry. Sauce. Nice. And... This will do us, okay. Hmm. Alright, so let's mix these around a little. I'm gonna need... One green and one blue. So, yeah, okay, that should do it. Oh, wait. Ah, uh, crud. Okay. Alright, and let's 
what do we got in the country? Oh, brisket blood and eggs. All right, well, oops. that we're gonna need to be next. So let's see. What have we got again? Unread and a red and a blue. like that and you'll be a master gastronomist in no time awesome watch yourself girl Otsu is missing and he's very crafty not to mention deadly uh -oh. who's Otsu? Ah, <laughs> it's a cutie now we may begin <laughs> Uh, a good hunter is always in tune with the ecosystem. You must be prepared to both nurture it and benefit from it. Hunt a beast and I'll show you what I mean. Ooh, gather an ingredient from the squiggle. Okay. Passable. Drop the ingredient at your feet. Now that the bait is set, we'll wait for a cheat sheet to arrive. Remember that you can drop ingredients you don't want during matches. After cheat sheets have been fed, they lay an egg. Eggs are natu a naturally high value ingredient that can be turned into sauce with an attack. Instructor, eggs are my favorite food. I know how to- Did I ask for your commentary? No, Instructor. Uh, that was decent. Now I'll go find a few more eggs so I can whip up a breakfast omelette. Ready for you once you finished your shift. Get to it. Yes, chef. Okay. Mm. Uh, let's see. Is 
so I need options. Uh, that's gonna be no. Okay, give me a sec. There we go. A bit, but I'm getting better at this. Oh, this smells delightful. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Okay. All right. to the scar on his arm, and revealed that it wasn't the mark of a monster, but an enraged opponent. Whoa, just because they lost the match? Mm-hmm. There's no honor in such an image. Wow. Whoops. It's later than I realized. I've got to get going. I'll see you tomorrow, Pontita. I like Pontita. She's cool. Most of the characters in this so far are pretty cool. All right. So there's that stunning dagger, that dash strike. Ooh, blank and spice. It smells like fresh pine and peat moss. That's one level three. Green, green. Ooh. Whirlwind lasts longer, moves around more, and does more damage. Uh, I've already got so many combat items though. Perfect talent is traditionally simmered with a bean paste and spices for a crunchy snack. Plus <laughs> Ah, plus five bone ingredients. Ingredient master. Variety isn't the only spice. Serve a dish that contains the same ingredient <laughs> five times. Um, serve a dish containing at least one ingredient per monster in the region. Ooh, that sounds hard. Ah, double knives. Ah, there's just so much stuff to buy. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get that fire pot. That way I can swap it out for my regular pan. And that leaves me with what? Uh, 57. So... Probably don't want to use it on... Well... Hold up, let me take a look. I've got sapphire deal. And I'm already gonna wanna swap that. So yeah, I really shouldn't spend money on that. Um so yeah, a cooking item would really be the best and We've already got one blue and, well, no, it's not really a colored one, it's a cooking, it's an expertise one, but... Any news? Oops. Oh, okay. 
So. The basic ingredients aren't amazing. Griffin Talons could be useful. Mm. Yeah, each of these only get you one. Just in case. Oh, and might as well get that too. Okay, cool. All right, so I think that's gonna be all for today's episode, but definitely come back tomorrow so you can see who I'm gonna pick to uh, fight. I'm not even sure yet, so <laughs> we shall see. All right, thanks for watching everybody. Um, be sure to like, subscribe, maybe leave a comment or check out down in the doobly-doo. You'll find my Patreon, PayPal, Twitter, and Tumblr. And again, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Have a good one. Bye.